Honorable Speaker, last week, something bothered me in this house. One of our colleagues, the Honorable Sechukubo, stood to raise concerns about how commissioners sat in a meeting, shared money among themselves, and how money is used in this institution. And you, right, Honorable Speaker, referred to his submission as nonsense. I found that wrong. I found that unparliamentary, right, Honorable Speaker. And with due respect, I would like to well, urge you, well, as you found it to wrong, well, apologize and withdraw that statement, right, well, Honorable as you Speaker. Found it wrong, well, as you found it wrong, there is something that is pending that is supposed to be that should be answered first. Where, Honorable Kazo also made an allegation. If you want me to apologize to you, I know you're a very big person. You're a leader of opposition. I, I'm sorry to you, the leader of opposition. Th thank you, Right Honourable Speaker. Actually, the apology wasn't just for me, but no. to the whole House, because... Allow me to finish this in a minute. No, I am apologizing to the leader of opposition. The, the House does not fault me for anything. Thank you, I Right Honourable Speaker. Does the House fault me? Th thank you, Right Honourable Speaker, for, for that apology. You see, a few weeks ago, the Honourable Wakai Mamsoke... Honourable he... members, please listen. Let the law talk. Yes, Right Honourable Speaker, as I was saying, a few weeks ago, the Honourable Wakai Mamsoke from Nansana did make a comment at the back of record. He was responding to somebody who said, uh, made some remarks, and then he said, that's nonsensical. He was off record. And, Right Honourable Speaker, you ordered him to apologize and withdraw the remarks, even when they were not on record. So my concern was that your submission of nonsense in reference to Honourable Sechukubo was on the Hansard, and it does not make us look good. In fact, I had expected that at the end of that session, perhaps you would address that matter, apologize and withdraw, and that's why I'm raising it now as a very serious concern. Because people out there do watch us, they expect us to operate with decorum, but also, right, Honorable Speaker, as you keep reminding us, we have got to operate with decorum. So I was only imploring you to lead by example. Thank you, Right Honorable Speaker. Thank you. Leader of Opposition, Mr. Sir, I am sorry.